How we doing today, folks? Uh, it's it's the middle of uh, morning. Apologize for the poor audio, but it's a nice cloudy day, and I wanted to get you guys a video of this. So what you're looking at right in front of you is uh, this is a little princess um, spirea, and then that's a PG hydrangea. And I'm kind of hoping if we linger back here, you can see what I was hoping to uh, to show you. But I guess we'll start moving in. So in this PG hydrangea, there's a spot where the trunk has rotted out. And um, some chickadees have made a nest. And we'll get a little closer. Usually I see them up in the wires. I don't know, maybe they heard me coming. But if you take a look at this hydrangea, right, right there, uh, there's a rotted spot. And the chickadees have, uh, there's three babies in there. And, you know, before I, I, I show you, I just want to mention that um, one time I took a course by the Northeast Organic Farming Association about growing things organically. And, you know, something they mentioned was, you know, when you see a dead tree, don't just instantly cut it down because our wildlife, you know, needs the space to make nests and such. You know, the woodpeckers eat the bugs out of trees. And this is a good example where I, you know, I never really noticed it until, um, until I saw this tree. But let me, let me move in for you. And I brought a light. And we'll see if we can get a, a picture of the new family. So we're looking in the hole. It's so hard to get a good view of that. I don't know, can you see anything in there? I hear a chickadee mom and a chickadee dad, chickadeean. I don't know, they're in there. There's three of them and they're scared. And she's, see right there? There's one of them. And the other one is flitting around over there. But, um, I can't, I just can't get the camera in there to get the light well enough. You can just see him. But um, I just think it's the coolest thing how uh, nature's... Well, I'm gonna move away so she can get back to what she's doing and she doesn't come over and kick my butt. Uh, I just think it's amazing how nature is all around us and we don't even notice and we think we control the environment, but boy, we do anything but control the environment. There, there she is. Uh, is that a chickadee? It's got like a reddish head to it. Where'd she go? There she is, okay. Come on, let's get you on camera. There we go. So that's gotta be one of the parents, but I don't think that's a chickadee, so I don't know what's going on. Doing a good job of pulling me away from the nest, though. That is a chickadee on a Japanese stewardia, just about to go into full bloom. That's not a chickadee. I don't know what that thing is. I don't know, do chickadees look different? Do the females look different than the males? I'm assuming this bird's going nest because I was near, nuts because I was near the nest, but that looks like one parent, and then that looks like you're more traditional. Where is it? That's gotta be our other parent. So I don't know if chickadees, males and females look different. That's what I assume a chickadee looks like. 